Tonight on News for Jax at 6, a local family is begging for answers from the public to help solve the murder of their 28-year-old son. Good afternoon to you. Family members of Sylvester Jenkins was shot. He was shot and killed inside his West 22nd home back in August. And they say it happened just days before his birthday. There's still no arrest in this case. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding shows us Jenkins family is now teaming up with the local anti-violence group Mad Dads in an effort to generate new tips. Sylvester Jenkins family says they became worried when they had not heard from him for his birthday. It happened in this home on West 22nd Street. Now they are begging and praying for answers. Dear Heavenly Father, thank the you. morning began with a solemn group prayer. Amen. 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 Then it was down to business. The group, spearheaded by Mad Dads, knocked on doors and passed out flyers, all in hopes of finding whoever shot and killed 28-year-old Sylvester Jenkins. I hate being here. I wish we didn't have to be here. But we're here needing answers. With supporting arms around her, Jenkins' mother, Kanika Hughes, said life without her son has only gotten worse. She says he'd only recently moved to the area, and Jenkins Dodge Durango was found burned. Since there, Hughes says the leads have run dry. He was just so kind, so kind-hearted, so sweet. I mean, I know you hear that a lot, but his picture was, well, his picture shows his spirit, his soul. Jenkins' aunt Yolanda Hughes returns to the neighborhood for the first time since her nephew's death. She tells us Jenkins' nickname was Bum, and like so many, he'd be getting ready to spend the holidays with family, a family that is instead hurting. He was a son, a brother, grandson, nephew, cousin, and he meant more to us than he probably meant to you guys, but please give us some answers. An $8,000 reward is being offered in Sylvester Jenkins' case working to find justice for a grieving family in honor of a young man taken too soon. Reporting in Jacksonville, Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station.